Hello, mi amor. So I am back with another video. I'm going to be organizing my makeup. So it's been a long time since I have gone through all of my makeup and cleaned it and gotten rid of the old stuff and my ipsy bags and everything like that and then i'm also going to just show you like a quick glance in my makeup bag that i take with me every day anyway you guys thank you for watching come along with me and let's get started okay okay mi amor so here is my makeup bag like i was saying no of course i do not wear all this makeup every day but i do like to have it with me just for precaution if you would say you could never be too prepared so I am actually right now see I was telling you guys that right there you can never be too prepared um, so what I'm doing right now I'm actually taking up all my NYX NYX however you guys want to say it and I had a few more in there but I love this brand like I've talked about it so many times it really is worth every little dollar that you spend so it's a higher end quality, <clears throat> excuse me, with a very friendly budgeter's pricing. I mean like, the little ones came as um, a Christmas gift for my husband, like it was a whole pack and even that was like super good deal. But the regular sizes and everything and the glosses are no more than like seven bucks. And they really work good. And then like if you go to Ulta, those sometimes have like buy one get one 50% off or buy one get one free and then you can use your $3.50 coupon off like it's a really good deal and then some of these things are also from Ipsy like that's from Ipsy I'm not a big liquid foundation person but I will use it when I'm out of my Estee Lauder um, compact that I showed you guys now here I'm just going through all my old makeup so I have new makeup, old makeup, yeah, see I have bins of stuff, face masks, those are all my Ipsy bags, and I just literally like want to organize them and put them all in its own place. Again, these are a lot of Ipsy's and free gifts for purchase. I like to try a variety, so if I like it, I can repurchase it. Some of those I have bought on my own, I'm, you know, I'm not going to lie, but a lot of them, like 60% of those in my medicine cabinet are all from Ipsy or free gifts or purchase from Estee Lauder or something else. So I definitely am huge into savings and everything like that. So anyway, I am going to go ahead and get started. I'm going to remove everything from my bathroom, bring it over to my bed, and I'm going to clean out the drawers, clean out my makeup bags, Ipsy bags, everything like that, and just go ahead and start decluttering. guys is I'm going to separate like at least try to get everything into category so all my lip products in one area all my facial products in another my eyeliners my eyeshadows that way when I want to organize it I know like where which pile to go to so that's what I'm doing right here And a lot of these things, I like I said, I'm going through them because there are a lot of them are old. So I am going to be getting rid of, I have a whole pile that I'm going to be getting rid of and I will be showing you guys that soon. Also, I'm showing you guys, I know it sounds really weird, and but if you are into face care and beauty care, like it's not a huge secret, so a lot of people do know this. But if you're not into that field, it's going to sound strange to you. But I am showing you guys right here, um, this is <laughs> hemorrhoid cream. And hemorrhoid cream obviously gets rid of swollenness, if you know what I mean. I've never experienced it, but hey, 
everyone else each his own. So if you put that underneath your eyes, if you've had a long night, a crying night, whatever, it lowers and deep puffs. It's not recommended to use all the time as like a regular regimen, but it's like a go-to 911. Just like a trick. So that's what I was showing you guys. Just a disclaimer out there. And so I already, I'm getting my pile and I'm going to go ahead and dump it in this bag coming up and it felt so good to legit just get rid of all this old nasty makeup that I've been hoarding. It was awesome. cleaning here. Hi hey guys, so I can't even explain this video. Like I've been contemplating if I even want to post it. It has taken me weeks to post this and days. Um, but I'm going to do it. Like, I don't even know. Like, I, I need to get my shit together when it comes to this. And like I told myself the last video, I was like, okay, I'm going to post one and like, another day or two and I didn't so I'm really sorry I know I always say this like I sound like a broken record at this point but um I'm gonna get it together I am I truly truly am so multiple outfits times weeks since the last video but um, I'm gonna show you guys pretty much almost a finished product like 90% just because I want to get this up I'm not a hundred percent done but I just want to show you guys like basically like the basis of what it's gonna look like so I truly truly appreciate all of your guys's love support and patience mi amores and so yeah let me just show you guys the finished product and obviously you guys saw how much makeup I got rid of and like everything else so let me just show you once again it's not a hundred percent but I have to get this up and it's basically what it's gonna be so okay let's do this okay so here like I said I half ass this video I still have like three to four other bags to be honest to go through and I was thinking about adding it at the very end after I closed out but again I just wanted to get this up and everything but yeah so this is just the minimums that I was doing and showing you guys and because of what I just previously told you guys I did not complete all of my other stuff so I once again am very blessed I know my collection is nowhere near all these beauty gurus are out there but I still feel very blessed to have everything I have and so like I said I still have a couple more bags that I need to unload and do I did get rid of a lot of makeup but I just wanted to put that out there um so what I did here is uh, my husband actually gave me this idea because I wanted to I needed more space because I still do have other, other stuff and so the way I had them stacked before it was like overloading so I asked him and he gave me the idea to like stack them like a book so I stacked my eyeshadows and what you were seeing uh, uh, I can speak what you were just seeing in the purple basket was all my like go-to face products uh, like for makeup what I'm showing you guys here is my um, skincare products I have I've shown them before like from Sephora and everything like that I have mini sizes so I could try which ones I like and then I just got that color science and I'm gonna be doing a whole video series on that to show you guys the progress here are all my face masks so basically what I did is just each drawer I just organized it from lipstick lip glosses eyeshadows face care and then when I get to finish I think like I'm on my last bag when I get to finish everything else I will go ahead and Add it into the drawers and so and then like I said my bottom this is another face care that's my PMD which I've done a video on I think I'm gonna do another one and then over here you guys will see my drawers from Walmart I went ahead and oh excuse me I recycled these candle holders and I used them they were so beautiful for my brushes 
I still am gonna use another one because my brushes are overflowing and I don't like that. I want to have like organization from like your eyeshadows, brushes, to your blending brushes. So I'm gonna start another one on that. And then this is just the minimum of the drawers. Those are all my MAC recyclables that I have not recycled yet. If you guys aren't recycling, no, I'm not sponsored, but it's a great foundation for HIV. Every time you recycle for MAC, you get a free lipstick or a free eyeshadow or a gloss, depending on the area, and they the proceedings go to So I do MAC. feel like I did not, like, give this video my all. Like, I feel like I did rush it, but it's not rushed, obviously, because it's been, like, almost a month, and you guys can see how many different days and everything that I've, I've um, taken to use it, that I've taken to make it. But at the same time, like I said earlier, I wanted to get it up, even though it's not completely done. Like, I also even want to, like, decorate this area and do, like, a bunch of stuff. But I definitely wanted to get this up for like motivation or anybody, especially with the spring cleaning coming up. And so I just, you know, I want to let you see me and like what it is and what I want to do and like what just makes life easier. And definitely when you declutter and you organize, it's so motivational. Like when you get like a new car or like a new body wash or perfume I just went from like zero to 60 from my car to body wash but anyway like when you get something new even a cleaning supply like you are motivated to get up and do it and and just work it and so like when you declutter and you organize it's the same thing and like it just keeps you motivated so I know when I watch videos or I see something like organizing I definitely like want to go and do it and it just makes your soul feel better like it just makes everything better so hopefully you guys aren't too irritated with all the different days or waiting and I really want you guys to know that I'm going to keep up and definitely take you along the journey with the new Fates products and I just appreciate all the love and support and like I said Mi amor, just be patient with me and forgive me and I will definitely be keeping up. So thank you so much one more time for all your love and support and um, I hope this video gave you some inspiration. I know it's half ass, but at the same time, thank you again. Don't forget to follow me on my social medias, which is my Snapchat and my Instagram, which are both under Malicious 97 If you like it, give it a thumbs up. If you don't, maybe not so much a thumbs down, but just give me some like comments on what I can improve on. So thank you again, and have a blessed day. Bye, mi amores.